add drains. Drains, drains, drains. Aha! That would explain it. The ones that I've done before, I've always had a problem with the, <laughs> with the showers because the water's just sort of spilled straight back out. I don't get it. It is a 5x5 five five room. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's get rid of the door as well. Uh, let's just collect, I think. Uh, dismantle. You go back out there. Ah, now the other issue is that's outside of my standard building now. So let's create another brick wall there. And then we can extend the fence to include it. And then demolish that. Mukana, how you doing? Nice to see you. Right, so what what's what's the problem with this? Surrounded by walls, has a door. Why is that not classified as done? Enclosed, surrounded by walls and doors. I'm confused. Right, you Go in there. Okay. Ah, right, okay. Thank you, that makes sense. Yeah, holding cell. There we go. That's now that's now fine. Now what's the problem over here? Enclosed, yes. Surrounded by walls, yes. I don't. I don't. Uh, right. Pause again because I want to know. I've got more prisoners coming in twenty-three minutes. Why is this room? Because that little bit there, that little bit there, was a shower. Exchange the wooden door with a jail door. So we have now eight minimum security prisoners coming in. And then we're going to have twelve, so... I can fit another six beds in there, that's not a problem, and then we'll hold it there for the moment. Add a metal detector. Uh, what? There would be a good place to have a metal detector. Uh, metal detector. Well, that didn't work very well. These drains don't work. Why are these trains? Oh, okay. All gone, that's fine. See, this is the point I don't understand about that. Okay, uh, oh, hang on. Uh, so I'm thinking putting a metal detector straight outside the dormitory door. So I'm going to put one in. 
Remove the shower door and put a drain on it. Well, you're saying I need another guard, is that what you're saying? Skeef, what do you mean? Uh, where's a good place to put that? I'm thinking of putting it like there. I can't put it there. Uh, let's get another guard. Add it to the canteen. Oh, what? Oh, what, have ones outside here? Let's stick one there, one there, and then, yeah, so these require direct electrical current. Remove the door, what, for the canteen? Hang on, hang on, hang on, I thought it was right. Cancel that, cancel that. So you're saying remove the doors. Put in metal detectors, which I had a second ago. No, I can't do it until the doors are gone. I'm still going to have one there as well, in, in the front of the dormitory, to stop people from doing what they're doing. Okay, right, pause. Um, I think I put that round the wrong way. So we'll get rid of that for the moment. Do that. Let's buy another. I don't think I'm going to. I just won't bother putting one there. Why are the guards hanging around out here? Do I need like a guard office or something? Right now, now I need to run electricity to it. So we're going to take it straight across to there, straight across to there. Build the beds. We need to build the beds. Um, objects. Let's just do this quickly. One, two, three. One, two, three. We need warden to command the guards. Okay. But the warden requires an office, so we need to create an office. Uh, brick building, which we're going to stick over here. How big does an office need to be? Office, uh, four by four. Okay. I'm actually going to build then. The warden's office is going to be here. No. 
it's not. Don't like that. Let's build the warden's office over here. So we put a uh, staff door on the front of it. And we we'll run some fencing around. If we can close all that, wait for me to get that done and then I'll. When that's done, I can then remove these. Okay, so a office requires uh, an office desk. A chair. and a filing cabinet. And then I have space here and over here to put more bits and pieces in. Uh, okay, so we need electricity down there. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to run that straight across there. With that, there we go. That's still fine. Okay, this is this is coming along quite nicely at the moment. In fact, what I'm going to do is I just want to replace that and that. I just don't like them. Right now, I can hire a warden. So now that I've hired a warden, I can now look at bureaucracy and stuff, can't I? One family is awaiting to visit, so I need a visitation centre. And a staff room, staff room, staff room, staff room, right. Staff room. Four by four, so another one of these. So let's build. A five by six there. With a staff door on the front Ah, that didn't create the back wall, it left the fence. That's not what I wanted to do. Right, 
what does a staff room need? Uh, a wide sofa and a drink machine. Okay. Wide sofa. And a drink machine. Designate that as an office and designate that as a staff room. Okay. Okay, anything else that I, I desperately need right now? I've got enough for the 12 prisoners that are coming in. the bureaucracy. Security. Requires a warden. Unlocks the chief of security. You can be hired from the staff toolbar. The chief gives you access to the deployment screen. Deployment screen. Ooh. Ah, that would be useful. Yeah, I've got a warden, but I need a security chief and then the deployment tab. So let's get the security chief. do that I'm also going to need another room down here because he'll need an office as well I would have thought Right, the other thing that Canteen needs, and I forgot about this, is some bins. Right, and again, then I need to build the brick wall to cover that back piece. desk chair and a filing cabinet go in there and then we designate that as an office okay this is going all right this is going all right. Okay, so should we make things a bit nicer for them? Should we put some? Uh, should we put some wood flooring in here. some wood flooring in for him. How's that doing? 
Oh, okay, I can now have a security chief. There we go. And they should have nice ceramic floors in their offices. And in the staff room as well, so we'll make that a bit nicer as well. There we go. We Let's give them. So we've got wood boots, paving stone around the outside. For the yard, let's turn that into a grassy area. broken one of the cookers. Okay, so can I now uh, do I have a deployment programs? Ooh, okay. Twenty more prisoners coming out. Um, right, so pause this for the moment because I don't want twenty more prisoners. I'm quite happy with what I've got. Let's see how many actual beds I can put into that one room. So one, two, three, four. So that goes up to. Uh, so that would take it to four, eight, twelve, sixteen. Two, four, six, eight. What am I doing? Can't. So, two, four, eight. No, two, four, six, eight. Plus, I already had two over, so I can take ten prisoners. Let's knock that down for the moment. We will take half of that. No, it's going to force us to take the 20, which means I'm going to need to put a new dormitory in. Right. Security chief. Warden. Oh. Aha, no, because I need to unlock that. Right, so. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8. I'm thinking I'm going to have to put another dormitory down here. door on the front of. Okay, and go. Come on, move. You've got 16 hours to do it. Worst prison ever. Not going to disagree with you, sir. Not going to disagree with you.
Personally, I'm surprised it's still going. But I am severely lacking in other things, so let's put another serving table in. Uh, put another table in. Like so. Put some more stuff in for the canteen. Right now, we're going to need brick walls to go around there, around there. This can be the scummy end, so we'll put toilet there and there. I'll be nice and give them Ah, we could do a kitty cam, we could do that indeed. Surely yours can't be worse than this, sir. This is not particularly well designed. Right, uh, utilities. So, we've got a big pipe there. Let's drag that straight down. That'll cover that. And then we'll put a small pipe in there. Go into that one. Might as well extend that a bit further as well. Kitty is right this second. Uh, this also needs some beds in it. Again, I'm going to have to find somewhere to put a shower. So let's put a bed there and a bed there. I'm thinking I'm going to put the... Uh, I'm just gonna rack them, stack them, and pack them. Oh, and I've run out of money. Crap. But I will get an influx in nine and a half hours, and then I'm gonna turn this section over here into a shower. Surrounded by walls and doors. In what way is it not surrounded by walls and doors? Surrounded by walls and doors. Okay, all right. Walls and doors. It has electricity, it has water. For some reason, it's saying it is not surrounded by walls. understand what I've done there. Right, I 
I'm tempted to just see if dismantling that will help. Why is that saying that it's not surrounded by walls? Is it because I selected that area there as well? But it worked over here. What's the difference? Alright, let's just make sure. I'm gonna It's got brick wall all the way around the outside. That's where the jail door goes. Right, it is a sealed room. What is wrong with it? Okay, if anybody can tell me what is wrong with that room and why it's not accepting it, do I need to get rid of these doors? Let's just dismantle those doors for a moment. See whether that fixes it. It's still saying that is not an enclosed room for some reason. Why? Can anybody see what's wrong with that room? Let's just demolish some walls then and redo it. Let's re demolish those walls and then we're going to put some new ones in once that's done. Now it's definitely not acceptable. Here comes some more prisoners. don't see a problem with that room. <laughs> because that, that square there again was set as dormitory. That's, that's what it was. That square there. Okay. It's being pernickety. Okay, so let's uh, build our shower room to go with this. Uh, brick wall. Objects, we want a shower head. There, there. There. I don't know what that was. It sounded like an alarm of some sort. And we'll put some drains in here. And then we're going to designate that as a shower. And we'll put some... We'll run some standard piping into this room.
Okay, so I've got 42 prisoners of 28 that I could use. Okay, so again, rooms, shower. I need to set that as a shower as well. No. Or I need to put a door on it. I need to put a door on it. Allows to permanent station, so can I now grab a security guard? No, I can't. Ah, deployment, there we go. Okay. Oh, I missed the pipe. Okay, that's now acceptable. We've got 42 out of 47, so we need some more, and I'm going to right now stop any more prisoners from coming in just for the moment let's put in another bunk bed there on it Actually, I can because I've got that wide. I can put another bunk bed there. Oh, hang on, that's the wrong way around. And there, let's cancel that one and put it that way. That should be enough. Nero, how you doing? Okay, so we need probably to put in now another cooker. So we'll put another cooker in there. We'll put another couple of cookers in. Make sure we've got enough. Right. So, deployment. Uh, let's see. Guards. Sign guards to sectors of your prison, so I want a guard in there, a guard in there, a guard in there. And a guard wandering around the outside. Okay. Awesome, now that's good. How many riots so far? None. None yet. <coughs> you want kitty camp? Yes. Uh, is there a, can I, does that pause the game? It does pause the game, right. Let's see if I can find the cat. Two seconds. Incoming kitty cam. Kitty cam. Your adoring public awaits. You've done 266 hours in this game, my god.
The cuteness is real. The cuteness is real. Right, cuteness overload. Come on. It's a sign of affection, Hero. And yes, he was trying to headbutt me. Right, so back to game. There's a pretty tap size turn. I swear I'm going to get another camera and have it like sat pointing just here because he has a habit of laying on the sofa just next to me but you can't see it. Right. Okay. Uh... So we've got a guard in there, guard in there, guard always in there, that's good. But what we don't have is anywhere near enough meals at the moment so let's hire another cook two waiting solitary confinement so that's something else we need as well we need solitary confinement so what I'm going to do is I'm going to fence off an area back here And then I'm going to start building stuff out the back there as well. Nero. Okay, I'm going to leave that for a moment because what I want I may need to hire more staff as well. I think an extra one in the canteen would be useful. Uh, and we're going to add... Okay, uh, anything else in bureaucracy we want to do as well? Maintenance. Unlocks a form and he allows you to do further research on things like prison labour or additional staff members like the gardener. Legal finance. Uh... Okay, we'll come back to that. Patrols allows you to find patrol. Well, that might be useful. Let's get that. Because what I need is a visitor center. So I'm going to build a visitor center out here. 
You think finance is an important thing to get next? Right, is that enclosed now? Looks like it, so I should be able to demolish that wall there. That gives me access to start building out here. And we'll run the paving slabs out there as well. I've got members of staff that are exhausted. That would be because I've got guards. Uh. Ah, midterms are over. Cool. Two awaiting solitary confinement, so don't have a lot of money at the moment, that's the only thing, but solitary confinement doesn't take up a lot of space. It's actually very, very good. So if I can build Yeah, let's build it against here. need to do is build solid doors 500 piece one two that's it for the moment a couple of walls oh, I can't do that yet okay play Damien the awesome how you doing Thanks for stopping by. Okay, so walls. If I put a brick wall there and there, I can then call that and that solitary. Do a shakedown. No, that just pisses everybody off. Okay, there you go. We've got two solitary confinement cells. What, do, what we do need is we need to put some more wood flooring down. Yowch. Yeah, can't do that. Some more solitary confinement down here. Right, so I've got 41 prisoners, 47 capable, so I can add six. No. Fill capacity. There we go, that's fine. Okay, Anne, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, I'm not doing the uh, Fan Friday tomorrow. I am going to be doing Darkest Dungeon now that it's at full release. Okay, so we've got six more turning up very, very shortly. I 
Well, we could speed up food delivery if I put a staff door just there. Good night, Anne. I'll see you tomorrow. Because they will pe take the path of least resistance, which is that way, so that will be much, much faster. Twelve prisoners have serious complaints. Okay, got some extras coming in. So I think I need more drains for that up there. Wow. I think I need to put a lot more drains in. Hurt, hurt, hurt. Drains of 20, let's just put that as a drain as well. I didn't realise you could put a drain under the door, so that's that's useful. I've got ten families waiting to visit, but I don't have enough money to actually build a visitor centre, I don't think. Let's see. Might be able to get away with it. Put a staff door on there. Have you got any mods? No, I haven't put any mods or anything on this. I don't know anything about mods, so I wouldn't know where to start, to be honest. Okay, so I just need to put the wall across the back. And what we'll also do is we'll, put, we'll be nice and we'll put some windows in. I don't speak Spanish, my friend. Sorry. Right, I need electricity over there. What do the, what do the mods do, mate? Honest question, I really don't know. I haven't dealt with them at all. Eleven families waiting. Uh, this is what I said. Hope you don't mind, my friend's going to try out my Gaelic capabilities again. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's just check our reports. Uh, for grants and see administration centre. 
Your two officers hire a warden, unlock finance through bureaucracy, hire a accountant. That's the one thing I haven't done yet. Medical ward, prison maintenance, visitation rights. Uh, ten guards, or staff room. Um, sorry. You have to play the game with extra things like no size requirements for rooms, creative mode allowing you to make money from spending, and can have different texture packs. Oh, okay. Well, that definitely sounds interesting. Uh, let's put in uh, that as well. Damien Yawson, thank you very much for that follow. That is much appreciated. 21 prisoners have serious complaints. Well, how do I find out what their complaints are? Prisoners. Oh, that's fine. Needs. Regime. We had a prisoner trying to escape, look, and he got caught. Ha ha. Where in England do I live? Uh, just north of, uh, a, a few miles north of London. Uh, right, what I haven't done, is whilst I've done that, I haven't actually stated that that is a visitation room. So let's also now add in a couple more of those benches. All oh, right, okay. Nice. I'm sure it's nicer there than it is here. Okay, so that should help with the visitation thing. We need some lights over this way. I don't want anybody escaping down these ways. So Florida now that's just mean telling me that you live in Florida. That's ju that's just not on. Uh, right, what other rooms do we need? A common room. What are the requirements of a common room? It's just okay. So let's build a common room then. Oh, I can't. I haven't got enough money right now. So what I was thinking is, I'll use this area here, this area here, and I'll build a common room there. One person requiring medical attention, so I am going to need to get a doctor uh, but again I need money to be coming in power is not an issue yet but could become so so let's just I'm just gonna let this build up some money for the moment don't think we're having any se severe issues what I am gonna do 